a Marine Corps officer who wishes to remain anonymous penned the following words. We're the battling boys of Benghazi. No fame, no glory, no paparazzi. Just a fiery death and a burning hell defending the country we loved so well. It wasn't our job, but we answered the call, fought to the consulate and scaled the wall. We pulled 20 countrymen from the jaws of fate, led them to safety and stood at the gate. Just the two of us and foes by the score, but we stood fast to bar the door. Three calls for reinforcements, but all were denied. So we fought and we fought and we fought till we died. We gave our all for our Uncle Sam, but Barack Obama didn't give a damn. Just dead seals who carried the load. No thanks to us, we were just bumps in the road. To the Marine who wrote that, thank you, sir. And now I have a few things to say. To every single person in this country who supports Barack Obama, it galls me to call you Americans. You are a disgrace to everything this nation stands for. Integrity, freedom, selfless service, honesty, courage, and honor. To the left-wing media who call themselves journalists, you are self-serving liars who stomp on truth to push an evil agenda. To the cowards and traitors of the United States Congress, the approval ratings consistently show that the American people hate your guts for what you've allowed to happen to this nation. You stomp all over good members of Congress who try to honor their oath, and you parade yourselves before TV cameras like you are some kind of rock stars. You are not. Glenn Doherty and Tyrone Woods, the battling boys of Benghazi, will not be forgotten in the treachery of Barack Obama, Hillary Clinton, and every person who sides with them will be exposed and brought to justice, either in this life or the next. This is Wild Bill for America. Thank you for watching, and America, bless God again.